Here we see someone that is really hopeful. They're dreaming. You, you're dreaming. You're hoping. Hoping about what? It seems like you've been in a situation and you finally got the nerve, the strength, and the audacity to walk away because it wasn't fulfilling. And even though you feel bad about leaving, it's not fulfilling. It's not, the person is not producing. It's not giving you what you want. And sometimes we just have to walk away from those things that just don't bring us fulfillment. It's not happiness. This is, you know, this is not what you want. And right now you're being the fool about it. You're being a fool. In other words, you're just going to jump. You're going to leap. You got hope on your side. You got faith on your side. And you're just going. You're just going to go. You're going to go for it. Whatever it is, you're going for it. You want more. You need more in life. And here I see cups. And I see that you're strong about it. You're very emotional about this. You're really strong and emotional. And you're feeling a lot of fear and insecurity. But remember, you are king and you can do what you want and not by gender, but by heart. And I see that in the end, that when you do do this, it looks scary. It looks spooky. It looks like I can't do it. It looks like I want to do it, but I'm going to go through changes and you're afraid of the outcome. Your outcome is going to be good. Yes, it's going to feel like bumps and along the road because nothing we want is easy all the time. But you want out of a situation and now that you want out of the situation, yes, you know you got to leap, you got to jump, you got to walk away. It's hard to walk away when you feel secure in something and you have to let it go. I understand that, but you got to trust yourself and trust the process and know that you are going to be all right at the end. You're the winner. That's my read.